Good morning. My name is Michael. Today, I would like to share with you a message. If you want to see less grass, you should grow the flowers. I'm a Hama Village student. Hama Village is an English school, and the place produces organic food. It is on top of the beautiful hill in Dak Nong province. When I begin to study, I need a study corner, and I go to a meditation house. And after looking around this house, I found the suitable corner. It is right next to a window. I choose this place because there is strong natural light. And I also enjoy cool breeze blowing through the window. Unfortunately, the first time I moved there, I saw lots of wheat outside the window. Because thick wheat is the place where insects live in. You know, it's likely I will be in danger because of these insects. So I need to get rid of this wheat. One day, in the early beautiful morning, I took some garden tools with me to dig out this wheat. Two weeks passed, we drew up, and it looked like nothing changed. It really made me disappointed. I'm a type of person, love the beauty of flowers. The other day, in the afternoon, right after studying hours, I walked around the village. I saw some cactus put, put up and thrown away by someone. Next to them, there was some wilted daisy. Immediately, I had the idea taking them to row in the garden corner next to the window. Here we have a lazy day, which is on Wednesday. And I had to wake up early at around 5 a.m. And I am really excited about my plan. My plan is to plant these flowers. First, I took care of wood and prepare a garden bed, then drove to kind of flower that are cactus and daisy. Finally, I water them. After that day, as usual, I visit the garden and water them every late afternoon. One month passed, I have a good result. There are more flowers than grass. At that time, I did not worry about wheat and insects. Finally, I have a beautiful garden that helped me relax. What I saw were less wheat, row and more flowers come up. From rowing these flowers, I find that if you want to change bad things, we must be replaced by the good things. Learning from this experience, so I apply to my life. I replace I display my negative thought by positive thoughts. For example, I write down affirmations that I'm an expert in English 
pronunciation. My pronunciation is better. I also break bad habits and build up good habits. As a result, these good habits make my life be better. Because of that, if you want to be better, you should grow the flowers in order to get rid of the wheat. Thanks for listening. My name is Michael. See you next time.